I'm Stuart Bloor. I've already lost a small pike, but hopefully I'll get this one on the bank. I'm going to have to perch really, but you take whatever comes along. So it's not exactly a hardship when you catch a pike, chub, bream, I've even had on this style of fishing. Anyway, that one's in the net and I'll show you that in a moment or two. And here you go. Let's get this one up to the camera. As you can see, not a big fish, but typical of the size of the perch in this particular water. That fish has now gone back. Typical pike sulking down the edge. Give it a few moments and it'll be off like an express train into the deeps. Sometimes you forget that you've got a pike down there at the edge and then the swirl of water reminds you that you've just released one. I just had another lunge on the retrieve. I think it's another pike. You can normally tell from the way the fish react. Indeed it is little bit bigger than the previous one. Hopefully I can land this. It's giving me the run around at the moment down in the margins but hopefully I'll wear it out, net it and I'll show you in a moment or two. As you can see there hooked cleanly in the corner of the mouth. I'm fishing with fluorocarbon and I don't get many issues with pike. Check out the comments box for the link to the uh, blog that will give you a little bit more of a rundown as far as the tackle is concerned but this video is mostly practical fish on the bank. If you're new to this type of fishing, never done it before, would like to give it a go, I'd recommend somewhere that has clear water. That way you can have a go in the margins or as far out as you can get and you can practice, watch the lure working get an idea of what's going on. When you master the working of the lure, then of course it gives you more confidence when you go on to venues where you can't necessarily see what's going on beneath the surface of the water. This is my last cast now. I've been here for about an hour. I've had three takes, two fish on the bank. Not bad when you consider that the water temperature is still very low. In fact, the pike that I caught had leeches on them, indicative of the fact that they've been lying low recently. So, overall, I'm happy. Above all, though, I've been fishing. That's what counts.